Hello everybody, this is Roger Hansen with uh, Tuts, Tips, Trips, Tricks, Reviews. Today I am going to be going over um, the Amazing 4-Way Universal uh, Combined Chuck Key. <clears throat> this is when I opened it and when I did open it, I actually can say that the package came in its appropriate packaging. There was no damage done to it, <clears throat> and there wasn't really much to it. Um, it's a four-way chuck key, basically, to tighten and loosen your drill bits and everything inside of your drill bits. So, um, packaging-wise, yeah, it, was perfectly fine. Um, there was no real problem of getting into it. It was insulated and everything like it's supposed to be. With that said, um, I would like to go ahead and uh, and uh, go to the order that I had and get on with that. If I can get all this straightened out. I'm uh, still working on the using the other features that are in the so have patience with me. When we bought the Amazing 4-Way Universal Key <clears throat> for drills, it uh, was uh, ordered on uh, through PayPal on May the 14th, 2018. And the estimated due date was actually... Um, get it all straight out right now. But the estimated due date was in July and I, the one issue that I did have was that the the uh, yeah here it is. <clears throat> the estimated uh, delivery was on Tuesday, January the twelfth and we didn't get the key until right around August in the middle of August at some time and <clears throat> it was a really long way. Another thing that I had an issue with and I find it on eBay all the time was that the guy, I, he was really nice and everything but he had a message it was from RRO493 uh, and with that I uh, had an issue concerning uh, that because when I turned around and actually uh, actually went to the yeah when I actually went to the uh, I'm trying these new features and they're kind of strange. <clears throat> okay, so let me go back and do this the proper way again. The the amazing four-way universal combi uh, combined chuck key is a four-way and different sizes and stuff. And like I said, uh, we paid a dollar seventy-eight. Actually, I didn't say that. 
with PayPal on March or May the 14th, and the estimated delivery time was June the 12th, which it didn't arrive on June the 12th. It actually, or, or July the 17th. It was uh, in August when we finally got it, and the delivery was from China. And one thing that we always seem to have when it comes to China is this issue that I had the name on the eBay message was RRO493 and there's no registered eBay user with that name or with the address that's given on the e email address up here which is rr0493 underscore g z 6206 udj at com h dot hk now after i turned around I gotta go ahead and do that. I really want to try these hotkeys, but uh, <clears throat> it's not gonna work out that well. And here is the address that I was uh, talking about right up here. And the order was made right here. It was for a dollar seventy-eight, which is a good deal. But like I said, when it comes to the actual name and everything. I uh, ended up ordering originally from this account right here. Now, this was uh, best uh, best tool 2019 on eBay, and when I got the email <coughs> in the information it said that the account didn't exist so I didn't like that plus the delivery was late the guy who was on there he was courteous and everything we even had a conversation and I said that the information or the tool did arrive and thanks you know and he said thanks and all that but that's the only thing that I had an issue with when I got it, the package was in good condition and there was absolutely no problem. It actually cost more for the shipping and handling than what it did for the actual tour. So, in that act, in that uh, aspect of it, it was actually a pretty good deal. Um, and that basically is what I wanted to actually uh, wanted to say when it comes to that. That's the only issue that I had. Now here before long I'll do a review on it and get <clears throat> everything worked out. You know, and try to pull together a good video for that. I want to apologize too for not being able to get any reviews out here lately. I've been having issues when it comes to um, putting stuff together on video and I started uh, trying to uh, buckle up and harden up and learn this stuff and get, get it all down and I apologize for any of the mess ups that I'm doing right here, but like I said, I'm trying to use more of the resources on the OBS and use it to make better videos. So, 
I'm going to actually just let the video run that way you guys can get a, a look at it and see for yourself if you, you know what it looks like. I'll get that profile out of the way right there. Like I said, it was it was appropriately packaged. Everything was in good order. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, subscribe, share, make comments, give feedback. I'd love to hear what you have to say. Thanks for watching.